Cuando sea grande, voy a ser arquitecto. Mi gran sueño es ser ingeniero. Cuando yo sea grande, quiero ser una doctora. <risa> Cuando yo sea grande, quiero ser un abogado. Quiero ser doctor. Guatemala is a low and middle income country located in Central America. We are 70 million people. And as any other developing country, we deal with urgent health issues that compete with the delivery of kidney care. Recuerdo mi experiencia como que hubiera sido ayer, a pesar que han sido muchos años. Me diagnosticaron con insuficiencia renal. Recuerdo que eran días difíciles. Yo tenía que ir a un hospital donde solo le hacían hemodiálisis a personas adultas. Yo me sentía bastante incómoda y me sentía extraña. Para los niños de hoy, ellos pueden acceder a tratamiento especializado, medicinas, psicólogos y lo más importante, el trasplante renal. Quisiera reiterar la importancia de la fundación que ahora le brinda a los niños la oportunidad y el tratamiento especializado y ese cambio de vida que yo pude experimentar. Annie's story was the story of all Guatemalan children with chronic kidney disease. But despite all of the challenges of delivering kidney care in a low resource country, Guatemala was able to develop a national referral center for children with chronic kidney disease. How did this happen? What's the story that needs to be shared? One milestone was the creation of a kidney foundation, the foundation for children with kidney diseases. And Annie's family was key in this process. The other important issue was the agreement signed by Fundanier and the Ministry of Health that allowed the provision of kidney care to all Guatemalan children supported by the government. A third milestone was the training of a team that included not just pediatric nephrologists but also dialysis technicians, renal dietitians, psychologists, social workers, pharmacists and for this we took advantage of international initiatives supported by ISN, TTS and IPNA. And now they have a chance. We have a chance. We are their chance.